you gon' do, uh When your pocket's low and empty Waiting on your stimmy and the bank ain't got no sympathy, uh Look, look, money, men, and ministry Tell me, is you feeling me? Collectors ain't no friend to me, uh Yo, Pastor Hines, take his time Show you definition and the truth behind the grind Bet you wish you managed it better Stormy days is over, homie, God got the answers, ayy Look, look, money, men, and ministry Ay, ay, money, men, and ministry Uh, uh, money, men, and ministry Look, look, money, men, and ministry, yo Hey, God bless you Hey, welcome to uh, Money, Minute Ministry uh, Wisdom about money uh, JLJA production I want to thank God for you Allowing me to minister to you I want to continue our study, and it'll be for a moment, as the young people say, about what I call your own annuity. Your own annuity. Annuity is a product that's sold by insurance companies um, to people to give them a lifetime cash flow. But the only problem I have with that is when you die, or if you have what I call a 100% joint spousal, uh, that, that significant other, um, you might have what they call a 75 or 100% payment. In other words, if the company was paying me $100 and I pass, Sister Hines will get the same $100. But when she dies, the payment is over, and this 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 lump sum of cash that generate this cash flow doesn't go to your heirs it stays with the company and so i want to share with you what i consider build your own annuity what do you mean uh, myself as the scripture says if i do not take care of my household i'm like a non-believer that's first timothy five and eight. Now you know we're using the word of God to build our wisdom about money. That's good. King James Version. First Timothy five and eight. But if any provide not for his own, and especially for those of his own household, he has denied the faith and is worse than an infidel, a non believer. Well let's see what the message Bible says. Uh, the Message Bible says it this way. Anyone who neglects to care for family members in need denies the faith. That's worse than refusing to believe in the first place. Okay, well, let's go to the translation. Hey, you know how we do it. Three deep here. Uh -huh. All right. It says this. But those who would not care for their own relatives, especially those living in the same household, have denied what we believe. Such people are worse than unbelievers. That's pretty good, uh, the New Living Translation. Well, with that being said, uh, let's get a plan uh, to build our own annuity. I have one here, what I call an estimated income folder. Estimated income fund. And you can see uh, it's something of mine. And uh, down at the bottom, well, let me get there first. Uh, yes, yeah, that's perfect. $7,081 this portfolio generates. What's there are uh, Stocks, you can see in the month of September um, or May, I guess $394. In June, $601. July, $838. Thank God for July. It's a hot month. I need a lot of ice cream. Uh, August is $396. So, how did I generate this? Well, I bought companies that paid me dividends. Uh, I'm like Warren Buffett. If you don't pay me, you can't have my money. I understand mid-cap and growth. That's a different story. But right now, I'm in that phase of my life with Psalms 9 and 12. Lord, teach us to number our days that we can apply wisdom to our heart. 
Remember I told you in Ecclesiastics, there's seven to eight ways. This is just one of those seven to eight ways. Generating a cash flow. I buy an insurance policy, say a quarter of a million dollars on me. So if something happened to me during my working years, my family can be provided for. But I just don't buy uh, the term policy. I use cash to build uh, an, an annuity base cash flow. I invest in mutual funds that pays dividends. I invest in stocks. Now this is over 30 plus years. And when I get to this certain milestone, I get rid of the term policy. Say I have a term policy that lasts 25 years or 20 years. And I govern myself accordingly to that plan. I got 20 years. I need to build a pot of a quarter of a million dollars to pay me, say 10%. That's $25,000 a year, close to 2,000 bucks a month. It's doable if you get a plan and go to work at it. And please get drip, dividend reinvestment. Dividend reinvestment. It won't cost you nothing. But if you don't, it will cost you something. Hey, stay tuned with me next week. Um, just building, the first thing is to get an insurance to cover you till you can get this lifetime income build up. Remember, 1 Timothy 5 and 8. If you are not providing for you and your household, you're like a non-believer. You want to get an annuity and you want insurance to back you up until you can get we're not going to buy the annuity. We're going to build our own. So when we die, our legacy, our inheritance, they can still receive. It goes beyond just my spouse. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So God bless you and may the Lord keep you. Until then, we'll talk about next Saturday some of the investments that pays dividend. God bless you. Well, praise God. This has been a JLJA Ministry production. Stay tuned for next lesson where God has brought me to teach and bring my pet preaching, education, and teaching. God bless you. See you next week.